Hi guys, welcome to Book of Shayla. Today we are going to be doing Follow a Sketch February Day 11. Here's the sketch. It looks like it's by Karen Gerber maybe from Sketchabilities, but that's the sketch. Mine probably won't have quite as many of the banners and everything, but we'll see what I come up with. So I have gone ahead and made my base page. It's again hot off the press because that is what I pulled to go with my freckled fawn for my weekly product focus. And I did go ahead and make some banners. That's what this little stack is. So let me put that over there. I just got finished walking my puppy and it's kind of, well, she's a dog. Uh, and it's kind of chilly out and now my nose is really running. So if I'm sniffing a lot, I apologize. But anyway, these are the pictures. This is my daughter and her cousin and then just another girl from our church. They sang, a, this was back in, oh, I thought I wrote it down. Um, do I have the envelope? Back in 2016, our church got redecorated. Um, they went in and redid the sanctuary and the Baptist, uh, the baptismal, baptismal, is that what it's called? Anyway, and um, this was our uh, dedication of the, of the um, church and they had the kids sing a song and all this. So these are my pictures from it. They're not great pictures. I didn't have a great phone back then. And you know, when you zoom in, they don't get great uh, quality pictures, but I did want to go ahead and document this. So this is what it's going to look like. Now they have theirs on, it looks like a just, I don't even know if there's a shelf underneath it, but I am going to make a shelf. I have this ribbon that I am going to build my shelf on. So let me get it down with my tear tape. I love tear tape. It's just such a nice product. Now my ribbon is really wrinkled, so I'm going to try to do this and get some of the wrinkles out. I cannot believe, oops, February is halfway over. Already. <laughs> the spring semester of school flies by. We just always have so much going on and it was even worse when my kids were in school, but it still is flying by. Kids are gone. This past week I had one day where I had my first three hours and then I didn't have class again until like um, the next to the last hour of the day because all my freshmen and sophomore were at a science fair. And so, but that's just kind of how the spring semester is. You just never know if you're going to have kids or not. So, that's all right. I At least I am used to this. And so, I know how to plan accordingly, I guess I should say. All right, I'm going to put this about right there. Now, I know it's not going to be straight, but I'm going to get it as straight, perfectly straight, but I'm going to get it as straight as I can. So, there we go. Now, I'm going to build this on top of the ribbon. I thought about um, putting the ribbon on top of the pictures to cover up like this, but I decided it was fine. And there's our straight and this is over a little bit, so I am going to do that. I did um, mat this twice, but I do think I will because I've had to cut off some people, or I I think the picture was already like that. I didn't crop it that way. So I think I'm going to do that. So you're not going to see much of this ribbon, 
but I'll know it's there. And I know I may cover up some of this down here. That's why I put it down there, actually. It didn't bother me to cover it up. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to move this over a little bit because I have a plan for over here. Now, they have a bunch. Of, they have like 1 through 10 in numbers over here. I have a different idea, but I need to move this in a little bit so I'll have a little more room. like that. Now my ribbon's fraying. I wish it didn't do that. Okay. I have these Mambi, me and my big idea stickers that are faith-based. And so the only problem is they're clear, but I think what I am going to do is just put them on a line down through here. So, um, uh, God answers prayers because it was definitely a big prayer. Now, what I can't decide, I think I'm going to do them sideways. You guys heard me say that it really pains me to do a title sideways. But I think I'm going to do these sideways. Woo! Decisions, decisions, scary stuff. God answers prayers. Okay. And then believe I'm just going to try to nestle them in and then expect miracles these are good quality stickers they are just I guess theirs did come down a little bit past the picture and it went over the, uh, above the picture too and then child of God I'm gonna go here and then bless Here. Ah. And then I also have faith. And I might put there. Um, hope. I'm trying to just kind of. Cover up some of these or, and pray. There, I kind of I like that. I like that. All right, so used up some of those. Now for my banners, I have cut some ribbon and some paper. And I'm just going to start putting them under here. This one's definitely going to have to be cut. Oh, maybe if I can, if I can get it in my hands. Actually, I think I'm going to put it under here and not under the picture. As I need room for what's going to go on top.
I'm just placing these down here and then I'll show you what I'm going to do to put them up for the top. Okay, my ribbons, again, are kind of wrinkledy and they're not perfect banner shapes because it's impossible for me to do that. But they're go it's going to look something like This one over here. It's going to look something like this. And then I'm going to take my freckled fawn. Because there's some circles that will, in my freckled fawn, the, um, that I'm just going to put on top. And I think I'm going to cut some small ones to fit in some circle with my circle punches because normally I could use the labels, but all the labels are rectangular. Hold on, let me look in here and see if I have any round ones that would match. Not there. Nope. These are all the Freckled Fawn kits that I used this week. So I'm just looking to see if maybe they have, there's some circle ones. Um, there's this one. That'd look okay. Let me pull that out so I'll know which one to put it back in. Okay, so I think I'm going to have to um, punch out some... Uh, some circles so let me do that with some of the paper that I have left over and I might not even use all of these but uh I thought I would use some but yes I have some scraps here so let me let me use them this way I can fill in some of the gaps I'm gonna do this and I will come right back. So hold on just a second. Okay guys, I'm back. So I have cut out a hole punch, not hole punched, used my circle punch and cut out a bunch of the circles. So now I'm going to, um, oh yeah, I had this one I could also do. So let me put this one in here. I really only wanted the yellow part, so I'm gonna cut it <laughs> so that I only have the yellow part. under here so that there okay so I have my chipboard ones I'm gonna have to glue them though so let me go ahead and do that get those out and ready let's see I think I want one here one here um might not do this one. I mean, I could put it there, maybe. And then the little one here, like that. What do you think, guys? Think that looks all right? I think so. Okay, so that's what it's going to do. And I'm pretty sure, oh, I'm going to make a title and I have some enamel dots. I think actually my title 
is going to just be um I can never get the things off this. I don't know why I struggle so much, but I do. There we go. <laughs> I don't know, should I just put church dedication? I don't know, that's so boring. I wish I was good at titles, <laughs> but I'm not. Let's see. It could play off the faith. Faith in God. And then I could journal a little bit about it. Well, I'm gonna just take part of the chipboard off that one then. Journal about this being, you know, a big project that for our little bitty church, it was kind of scary. We raised money for, we, couldn't decide if we were going to raise all the money first and then build. But we decided to trust in God and that he would give us what we needed when we needed it. And so, and he did. He provided all the funds for it. We didn't take out a loan. We just built, started building and praying. And at each time we needed more money for something new, he provided it. So I think I'm gonna journal about that. So I think I will say faith in Sorry if you can see the top of my head. I wonder if I have room for God or if I need to put it down here. So let me let me start at the bottom. Start at the end. Work my way back. Is that going to be too tight? Yes, it is. Okay, so let's put it down here. Faith in... Gone. And then I'm going to put the year down here in the corner. I think I'll put it down here just to kind of even things out. And it was 2016. I love these freckled fawn letters. And that they give you two sheets of them. So you can spell things out. And this is my last Freckled Fawn product focus kit. So next week, um, I think I've decided not to do a weekly wrap up and show my next kits. They just, the videos don't seem to be what people wanna watch. And so um, I think I'm just gonna skip that this week. And especially since I'm already doing, you know, a video a day with the follow a sketch February. So with that being said, I will go ahead and tell you though, that my kits next week, my product focus is, um, cut files. And so all my kits will have cut files next week. So yeah, that'll be fun. Well, maybe I'm just going to, Sprinkle some dots all around. These are the exact colors I need. So I'm just gonna add some wherever I, just wherever. I'm not gonna be in little clusters like usual.
but uh yeah so if you did like watching the build a kit or not build a kit but if you did like watching the um wrap up and the new kits let me know down below and i mean i'll gladly do them i just like i said last week's only got like 24 views or something and so i was like well maybe people don't want to watch that so which whatever my subscribers would like to see is what i will do for you okay now i am going to put just a little cluster here i think i'm going to do a big brown a medium pink and a small blue and then i need to put one more little blue just so they'll be even because that's how I like things. And I'll put it up here. Oh, I don't think I glued that one down. If I did, it didn't glue down very well. Like that. Okay, that is going to be it. Like I said, I think I will do a little bit of journaling maybe over here. Um, there will be a still shot at the end. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see all my follow a sketch February from here on out, plus my 30 days of sketches, Christy's Beautiful Life in March, hit that subscribe button down below. I've already started videoing some of those um, videos for next month. Look at me go a month ahead. That's crazy. But anyway, um, thank you so much for joining me today and I will see you next time. Bye guys.